topic about females come on here. Let's Let's go. Go. Coming in clutch, no cap. But look, man, today, as you guys can tell by the title, it's a story time on how I came out. You feel me? How I came out the closet, how I came out the jam. You feel me? Okay. Now, this this little story time is funny. It's really funny because I would never think that that day that was gonna happen. Alright, y'all, before we get into this video, make sure you smash the like button, turn on your post notification notify every single time I post, and you can get your post notification shout outs. Which post notification shout out goes to two people for today Leslie Gomez. Thank you for having your post notification shout Shout out, you said shout out, please. There you go, you feel me? Thank you for supporting me. And the second person is F R 4 I D 3 L Y N R. I don't know how to say your name. Bro, what are you talking about, man? Yeah, y'all, thank you guys for supporting me. You know what I'm saying? Keep your post notification shout outs out. You know, for every single time I post, man. And if you guys want a post notification shout out, all you have to do is comment down post notification gang or whatever you want to call me you know what i'm saying to get a post notification shout out one hour later look man subscribe and let's get straight into the video man and go all right y'all so let's go ahead and let it start how it all started man are we here you feel me summertime you know what i'm saying summertime is when everything goes down it just it's always a problem in summertime you feel me like you know what i'm saying things really be you know what i'm saying going down in summer you know what i'm saying my nigga I ain't gonna say too much we'll be going down the summer you feel me but if you know that you know you know what i'm saying i think this was actually two summers ago i'm pretty sure it's eighth grade moving on to the ninth grade right he was actually in um ct you know what i'm saying if you don't know what ct connecticut you know what i'm saying he was in the connecticut some of my family live over there and stuff so we was over there getting lit as always my family be lit we be lit it's just like that you feel me and this is two scenarios there's two scenarios to this story you know what i'm saying so pay mind to that boom we in there you know what i'm saying and just getting lit everybody lit boom boom oh my god and y'all probably asking like how how does getting lit have to do with out here coming out but <laughs> people there you feel me it was a summer i really don't remember what we were celebrating or what we was doing but i think it was just a barbecue or something like that it was like a barbecue there was, there was some some females there um there was you know my family mama boom 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 right so we there chilling everybody's you know what i'm saying woo -woo -woo. the only person that knew that i was into females at this time was my brother he's not like my blood brother but we grew up together so much like babies so we call each other brothers you know what i'm saying brothers and sister so boom my brother he was the only one that knew well him and like um one of our close friends you know what i'm saying so he, we was all there you know what i'm saying and you know how we're being a party you know what i'm saying like they're all the all the little you know what i'm saying teens whatever they be around each other woody woo right and i'ma just say this by the way i dress you can tell a lot already you know what i'm saying i don't really need to explain too much um because you could tell you feel me so i'm in there right and you know um i'm over here looking like a whole little tomboy i had um i was wearing some like type of shorts and stuff like that you know what i'm saying and i was i was um i was dressed the way i was dressed you feel me and like people was looking at me i know when somebody looks at me like i know when people are thinking something and they had like yo she's off like there's something off you know what i'm saying and i let that be you feel me what it is. It is what it is. sometimes they would say things like little comments here and there about like you know what a woke and i would just be like you know what i'm saying like Shh. you know what i'm saying top secret that's none of your business Shh. you know what i'm saying i wasn't trying to make the block hot you feel me i was trying to keep it low key all the way low key i was not trying to let nobody know nobody nothing none of that none of that it starts getting nighttime you know what i'm saying what a woke so me already being with the females and all that and the way i was dressing was already kind of giving it away but at that point i wasn't really thinking because it was like they didn't confront me about it so i didn't really care you know what i'm saying so we go back inside the house it's nighttime you know what i'm saying and we was just chilling inside we was on the couch everybody was just chilling and talking now imagine how embarrassed i felt because of all the people that were in that living room you know what i'm saying and i'm just sitting down minding my business you know what i'm saying and you know we was playing a cards game you feel me a cards game for money you know what i'm saying and the card game 
when when you play the card game, you know what I'm saying, you 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 get intense. You feel me? You get intense because it's a card game. You feel me? I'm a very competitive person. I be wilding. Like I be ready to, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, get into it. I don't play with that. You feel me? I'm really a competitive person. I get mad when I lose. I don't like losing, but I mean that's obviously part of life, you know what I'm saying? And me and my brother, we trash talk. That's just how we are. We trash talk. When we play 2K, we trash talk. When we play this, when we play that, when we play woo woo, we all trash talk. It's just the way we play, you feel me? So we playing the game and we trash talking, right? So boom. Then the whole topic about females come on here. You feel me? Now they don't know ish, you feel me? So I gotta sit here and act like, ooh, I like boo. Oh, no, no. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I gotta oh, sit here and act like a whole different type of person, you feel me, for no type of reason. Like, I shouldn't be doing that, you know what I'm saying? But that was like how I covered it. Hey, they was talking about females and I'm over here acting like I don't know shit. Like, hey, I don't, I nigga. <laughs> I don't know nothing. I don't, I, don't, I don't know nothing, but I don't know nothing. I don't, I don't, I don't know nothing. Wait, what the fuck is that? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm over here trying to act all the scars and shit. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to, hey, again. I'm not trying to make the black card. So since I wasn't trying to make the black card, it was everything was low key. <laughs> until, you know what I'm saying? Until. And my brother, a couple females, da 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 da. So I'm over here putting my opinion on them. You feel me? Cause he we close like that. We know about them. You know what I'm saying? So we we out here talking about it and chatting it up. We got into this conversation about girls dubbing people. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how we got into this conversation. I'm not gonna cap. Your boy was sure. You feel me? I was sure. You know what I'm saying? It is it is. I still probably think I'm sure to this day. I really don't care. Back then, I used to get, you know what I'm saying, dubbed. Your boy used to get dubbed. I was I was sure. Give me a break. You feel me? Like, I was sure. You know what I'm saying? If I'm sure, you can't really, uh, like, what, what, what you want me to do? You know what I'm saying? So, I was sure, you know what I'm saying? So I got dubbed, you feel me? I got dubbed, and by one of them, it was it was this girl that I was mad into. <laughs> like, I used to really, really like this person. Till this day, I still know her. I'm not gonna say no names, you know what I'm saying? Because that's gonna do too much, you know what I'm saying? But I really used to like this girl in middle school, and I got dubbed. You know what I'm saying? I got dubbed. Your boy got dubbed because I was sure. You know what I'm saying? I was not trying to make that hot at all. You know what I'm saying? And again, we was talking about the girls that have dubbed. And I was making fun of my brother. My brother said he got dubbed by a female. You feel me? And I was like, I was laughing because it's like funny. But again, he's supposed to keep my cover down. You know what I'm saying? You're not supposed to make the block hot. On him, I'm like, ah, you got dubbed. You feel me? You got dubbed. Obviously, my brother gonna feel away. I understand why he felt away. Because why am I making fun of him? When he he knows who I got dubbed by, you know what I'm saying? And he knew the person in person too. He got mad and he was like, I don't know why I said this line right here, bro. I don't know why I said this line. I said, man, I could never get dubbed oh, by no female. Like, why would I even say that, bro? This dude said, what? You got dubbed by? He said the name, bro. He oh, said the no. name. Oh, he said the name. It was a girl name. Like, you can't. You can't even try to knock that name because it's a girl name. Like, and when he said her name, I was so, I was like, what? I was shocked. Like at the moment, I stood there for 10 seconds. Like literally, I didn't know what to do. Like I was just there. I got up, bro. I said, boy, you don't stop talking like that. Stop talking. I said, boom, nigga, that shit was done, bro. What you talking about, bro? Bro, I smacked him, bro. And I violated. I felt bad after. But it's like, you got to keep my block. Why you made the block hot? older older brother which is his brother was like huh like he was mad confused his girlfriend was there like huh everybody who didn't know english was like huh so i'm over here like oh my god no he did not and i went upstairs i just went upstairs and i literally got to one of the rooms i don't even know where i went to be honest i was like out of it i went to one of the rooms and i locked myself in the closet <laughs> I locked myself in a closet. That's how that's how mad I was. I was just there like mad and shit and like just like crying and stuff because I was just tight like yeah man after that I mean we apologized to each other and everything but I was just like damn yo like two scenarios was just me telling my mom straight up. So that's basically the end of this story man. He made a block hot. I got tight. That's the end of it. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this story time. You know what I'm saying? My edits have been going crazy. I know y'all been messing with it so I'm gonna keep up the good work. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, make sure y'all smash the like button, turn on your post notifications. Now you can get a post notification shout out in the next video. Go check out all my social medias. Go ahead and subscribe, man. We are on the road to 10K, man. And it's been Destiny, man. I'm out. Nah, we out. Peace.